that was the blessing in my life to to get to know her this 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 goddess that I saw on stage when I was 15 to really get to know her and 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 appreciate her her warmth and her her joy and uh, always loving to dance but loving life and okay so I'm segueing now to at your house we I came early the last time I saw Marjorie we were having a wonderful dinner and um, she was having a really really hard time I talked to her on the phone, but you know she she was re really struggling, and uh, she never complained. She didn't want your sympathy. She she just she just wanted to get out of bed. So you told me, Diane, that she stayed in bed all day to come to dinner. She was there all day to get her energy to come. And at first, I thought inside, I thought, gosh, that she shouldn't do that. That she should just you know stay at home and rest and and. and conserve her energy and and no there she was and and it, it she was fantastic it was stunning she had the blonde wig on yeah. you know and she had a great time I kept I almost forgot that she was had gone through what she'd gone through right she we she had a, a great time and but then again I'm going this woman is so brave she is so courageous and the imparting that to me again showing me the way again in a way I, I get to this place and I go you know I have to share this with you uh, years before that um, <clears throat> I literally bumped into Gwen Verdon on the street I mean we on 69th and we, we, we hit a brick wall because I was coming out of a restaurant after with friends after Michael Bennett's memorial service and Bob Fosse had just died a few weeks earlier, and Gwen had left the company in Washington, and we hadn't seen her, so uh, I was just off for the night. She, we bumped into each other, and, and those beautiful eyes, and the tears welled up in both of us, and I said, Gwen, are you okay? Um, we're worried about you, and she goes, we keep them alive inside. <laughs> We do, and I will. And you know, um, before I leave, I really um, am happy to be here, to have my feelings with you, because I guess what I'm trying to say is that there's always that 15-year-old girl inside of me. And when I hear Marjorie's name or I remember her, that's the vision I will always have with all the other wonderful ones that we sh shared in a very intimate way, but that's the vision that, that, that got us in green. <laughs> and uh, my gratitude also will follow that vision. Thank you.